All right, Joe, what brought you to Crawford, Crossroad Renaissance, man? Okay, uh, I was getting ready to graduate college. Uh, I needed to get back in shape. Uh, I was just sitting at home, miserable, fat, and uh, I heard about this place from a mutual friend. I uh, was real hesitant about coming here at first, but uh, I started watching uh, YouTube videos about it and uh, Instagram, obviously, social media. Cool. I uh, saw a guy who was about 60, 60, 60, 60 I'm going to say 65 years old, flipping a tire. And uh, I just, I looked on the website, I filled out the uh, email. Uh, Bill called me about two hours later. I came in, we talked, and uh, I've been here since uh, February of 2015. Nice, man. So what was your first impression when you first started working out, man? Uh, it's hard. Uh, I wasn't used to any of the uh, lifts. Uh, any of the exercises. Uh, I, I had done CrossFit before. I, I used to box a long time ago and uh, tried implementing a little bit of CrossFit into it. Uh, I, I did two classes at another gym. I wasn't really too happy with it. I was uh, being told on the fly and I was afraid I was going to hurt myself uh, coming in here and uh, meeting Bill and everybody else. It was like people actually cared. And uh, the guy, I just I felt safe working with, with you guys. Cool, man. So you do one-on-one -on -one training. What made you choose personal training? Uh, personal training, uh, basically I do it because uh, in a classroom environment, uh, there's a ton of people. Me, I'm personally, I'm self-conscious about working with other people. I mean, I've done it, I'm not opposed to it. But uh, I feel the one-on-one -on -one training, like if you mess up, uh, the coach is right there and you can correct it right away uh, compared to a class environment where you got about five, six, maybe 10 other people and the coach can't be on you at once. So if you mess up, you might not know you messed up, but uh, if you're with one-on-one -on -one training, if you mess up, the coach is right there to uh, correct the situation right away. Cool, man. What's the toughest part of training for you? The toughest part of training? Uh, I hate uh, any, anything with the kettlebells, like cleaning presses with the kettlebells. Uh, thrusters are not my favorite at all, but I, I don't. You know, it's the, it's the things we hate the most that are roughly good for us. Uh, I used to never be good at jumping rope. Uh, I'm actually pretty good at it now after a lot of practice and uh, it's just repetition. I mean, I used, to, I used to hate running. I Growing up, I was lazy. I used to hate working out. Now I'm like a, a fiend. Cool, man. What's your favorite memory of CrossFit Renaissance? CrossFit Renaissance? Oh, man. Uh, I guess just, just meeting everybody. Uh, everybody's been real good to me. Like I said, this, this is a place where people actually care about you. Like they're not here to hurt you, they're not here to kill you, regardless of what some might think. Uh, probably my favorite memory is, uh, I don't know, skip PRs, man, just personal records, and uh, just being able to uh, increase. And uh, I, I've lost about 25 pounds since I've been here, so that's been pretty good. Awesome, man. So so what kind of results have you seen? You said you lost 25 pounds? Uh, uh, well, I got a, <laughs> I've never had abs. <laughs> never uh -huh. had abs, never had ribs. Uh, when I was when I was boxing, I used to get skinny. But I used to like look trained, and uh, there was no there was no definition. Here, I uh, I actually like have abs, and uh, when I get a little more uh, conscious and not self conscious about myself, I'll, I'll post pictures. But uh, I've showed Bell pictures from August to October, and you can just you can just see the results. I mean, this is this is the truth. This ain't a joke. All right, awesome, man. So what would you tell someone that was interested in starting but kind of unsure uh, if they want to start? Uh, I would tell them just to, uh, just to uh, come, come, and, come and see us. You know, it's, you ain't, there's no pressure. That's, a, that's another thing when you come here. There's absolutely zero pressure to sign up. Uh, I was actually a little intimidated uh, when I first came in. Uh, like I said, you just got to be open-minded about this situation. You're going to do a lot of uncomfortable movements that you not, might not be used to. Like, I'll give you an example. For me, I never used to squat. Uh, anybody that's here will tell you when I first started, I couldn't squat for anything. Uh, but we practiced it, and uh, I got my form down a little bit better. And uh, I can just, it, just get, you gotta be open-minded about doing it. So you can't be, you can't be scared, and uh, you just gotta come in and do the work. Awesome, thanks, Joe. All right, brother.